All right, g'day guys. Welcome back to the True Footy YouTube channel. Today, we are doing an AFL Obscure Players Challenge. Hmm. Druzy, one of the guilty pleasures, I think, every AFL Midget fan. Midget porn. Yes. One thing that has always tickled me, other than midget porn, is uh, is remembering obscure AFL players. And today, we're going to do a challenge in the theme of that, playing a little game that I've whipped up with some very complicated rules, basically to test our knowledge of obscure AFL players. So, as part of this game, we've both come up with a list of 10 players for the other person to guess, and we can see how many that the other person can get Thank you. off their, t that, their team. We gotta nice. guess the team. Seamless. So the rule is one person says the name of a player, Brent Deledio, for instance, and the other person has to prove that they know who that player is by naming at least one club that that player played for. Who did Brent Deledio play for? GWS and Richmond. Nailed it. I was gonna say the ball dogs. Obviously, in the game, it won't be players like Brett Deledio. It's gonna be more obscure players, so there are some rules. Obviously, we're from different eras. I'm 27, you're 20 years old, uh, so there's different cutoffs for what obscure players means to you and me so yeah we can't I can't name players from 2003 because you hadn't been fucking born yet yes I had yeah I know so yeah I've gone with players after 2006 and you've gone with players after 2012 exactly right so we have to name a player that has played at least 30 AFL games and yeah like you said uh, has to have played one game after 2012 for you mm -hmm. and one game after 2006 for me we have made an exception though if you can name a player from the Eagles that's obscure they don't have to have played 30 games and likewise, if I name a player for Fremantle, they don't have to have played 30 games mm -hmm. uh, because, you know, we should know our clubs better than that. Yes. We should know. We'll we should. see what happens. <laughs> so you work it out as we go along. Basically, we name 10 players. Whoever gets the most right wins. However, we have included some bonus points because it wasn't already complicated enough. If I name an obscure player for you uh, and you can't name them and they've played 100 games, I get a point, yeah. even though it's not my turn. If they've played 150 games, I get two points. If they've played 200 games, it's three points. And anything beyond that is probably, you know, once I've played 200, you should know them anyway. Yes. Equally, if I name a player from Fremantle that's obscure and you can't name them, I get two points. And you get two points likewise if you name an English player. So, without getting into any more rules, uh, let's get into the video. So, Drewsy's going to hit me with 10 obscure players and I'm going to see how many I can get right. All right hit me with All the right. first player, Drews. <laughs> All right. Why are you giggling? I don't like the sound I don't, of that. I don't know how to say his name. Michael Dofty. How do you spell it? D O U G H T Y. Michael. Oh, Michael Dofty. Doughty. Doughty. Yes. I want to say Adelaide Crows. Yes. He nice. Played, he played 230 games. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Wow. You were hoping. Yeah, that's fair enough. So in that instance, if I'd got that wrong, then you would have gotten three points. That's the game. Nice. Now you understand a little bit better. Let's get into the rest of them. Ed Barlow. Uh, I want to say he played for multiple clubs, but one of them was Sydney. Yes. 34 games for Sydney and the Bulldog. Two from two. Seb Tape. Gold Coast Suns. Fuck! I thought that was very obscure. Three from three. He was an inaugural Gold Coast Sun when he was drafted. Rats. Jamie Graham. West Coast. Damn it! <laughs> that was my He's still a coach one. there, bro. Rats! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get clapped. Four from four, bro. Alright. Sam Dwyer. Ooh, that one's harder. Uh... I want to. I've got Carlton vibes from this. No, nope. Collingwood. Mm. Yes. Damn. Fair enough. All right. So I finally got one wrong. Uh, Sam Dwyer played 39 games for Collingwood, I think. Matt Egan. Matt Egan. Oh, Geelong. Yeah. Nice. nice. I was thinking of Chris Egan. Used to play for Collingwood, but that was well before then. Yeah. I've gone for plays with lots of games. I probably should have gone more obscure, but that's all right. Uh, um, yeah. You said you were going to make it really hard for me. Yeah. Because so I, I don't know these players, but that's yeah. Right. Fair enough. Yeah. For my time. Yeah. Different eras. Uh, <laughs> this one you're definitely going to get, but uh, David Myers. Oh, Essendon. Yes. Fuck. All right. Simon Wiggins. Carlton. Yeah. Nice. What am I? Seven from eight. Yeah. Oh damn, Two homie. More. Alright. <laughs> Joel Patful. Brisbane Lions. Fuck. Okay, played 220 games. I suppose it's hard for you to know who's obscure and who's not. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright. Daniel Gilmore. Ooh. That's thrown me a little bit. I want to say it's a Victorian club, but don't don't tell me. Uh, fuck. Western Bulldogs. Mm. Frio. <laughs> oh, actually, you know, now that you've said it, Frio, I can, I, I don't, I couldn't tell you what he looks like or anything like that. Yeah. But yeah, no, fair play. All right, so that's eight out of ten. Yeah. So I'm gonna get nine to win. Nice Easy money. Let's All go. All right. Yes. Um. Although I could still get points if you don't get the one. So my score hasn't completely ended True. yet. True. But we'll see. We'll see. I'm gonna get thrashed. Now, just to clarify as well, if if you can name one cl club that the players played for, yep. you still get it right. Yep. So you're just proving that you know, and obviously you can guess. But uh, that's the fun of the game. <laughs> Alright, sweet. My first obscure player for you, Drewzy, 
Well, I got him scared. Kyle Shaney. <laughs> oh, no. How do you spell it? C-H-E-N-E-Y. Can I have it in a sentence? <laughs> <laughs> My player is Kyle Shaney. <laughs> I have no idea. Yeah, no idea here. Well, you can take a stab. Um, he 50, has, 50. <laughs> well, it's actually, you've got a two in a, out of 18 chance. He played for two clubs. In fact, I think he played for three. So you've got three out of 18. You've got one in six chance of guessing this. Oh, fuck. Uh, we know uh, that we've established that you don't know who the fuck it is, but you can still get a point here. <laughs> Where do I want to start? Played 83 games. GWS. Wrong. Mm. Carl Chaney started at Melbourne, okay. and I think he played for Hawthorne and Adelaide. If I've got the order oh, right. Oh, I was thinking Adelaide. Yeah. Rats. All right. All right. So a commanding start. Yes. For you. <laughs> now this one you should get right because he has been featured in a video that we've done, and I'm giving you hints here out of charity. But the second player is Angus Graham, or as the players called him, Silent G. Angus Graham. <laughs> hey, Angus Graham. <laughs> yeah, I got that. What, what, when have we talked about him? Well, if I make it any more specific than that, you're going to get the point. I reckon it's between Collingwood and Richmond. Does the anus give it away? <laughs> <laughs> I'll walk in Richmond. Oh, with the biggest plucker from your cheeks. Yes, Angus yeah! Graham. Yeah! Richmond. You did it. I think he was one of the first 22 that Hardwick had. Yeah, okay. That's what Oh, that's why he gave it away. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Charity. Now, this player is a player you should get, but I'm not confident. <laughs> Matt Maguire. I no, suck. No idea. How many games did he play? 170. So Fuck. I've got potentially two points Matt out of Matt McGuire played for two clubs. I don't know who he is because I'm an absolute nuffy. Look, I didn't follow the AFL intently literally until like last year. Yeah, I know you didn't. So This game really is skewed to me. I've always just followed Freo. Matt McGuire played for Essendon. No, he didn't. He played for the Brisbane Lions and St Kilda. Yeah, no idea. <laughs> Tune in for the rest of the video and Drewsy's capitulation. This is like a trigger meter video. Let's see how triggered you can get with the players that I don't know. I feel so bad about the rest of this list because I think they're actually got harder. Because uh, this is a player that I would definitely have got wrong. Mark Austin. Oh. Two, cl uh, two clubs. How many games? 44. Oh, Mark Austin. Definitely played for Carlton. Oh, well played. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Mark Austin, good player, yeah. <laughs> I have no idea who yeah, that is. All right. Might have to go into last round double points. <laughs> <laughs> the fifth player, Cam O'Shea. Sydney. No. Mm. Uh, played for Port Adelaide and Carlton, I want to say. Cool. He was also at, played 92 Lucky. games, so that was gettable. Two out of five, Drewsy. The next player on this list is probably not that obscure and more of a well-known player, I would think, but we'll see how we go. If you didn't get Matt Maguire, you might not get Alapate Carlisle. <laughs> I haven't known one of these players. Yeah. Not one. He played 167 games for one club. 167? Yeah. What's his name again? Alapate Carlisle. Alapate. Uh, he was of Fijian descent. Definitely not Melbourne, is it? It's definitely not Melbourne. Mm. Sorry, mate. It was the Port Adelaide Football Club. Alapate Carlisle. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> the next player... <laughs> Is Jacob Ballard. Oh, I've heard that one. Oh, I've heard that name. Ballard. This is going to annoy me. I've heard that name. <laughs> Fuck. Western Bulldogs. No. No. Mm. It was Fremantle. Oh. <laughs> Dean Polo. Adelaide. Mm. No, played for Richmond. <laughs> Sick. I think he was also at St. Kilda from memory as well. Uh, the next one is Jonathan Simpkin. Two clubs. No, four clubs. Collingwood. Don't think he played for Collingwood. Ah! He played for Geelong, Hawthorne, I want to say Essendon, and let me Google that actually, just in case I got that wrong. I'm pretty sure he played for Collingwood, bro. Everyone's going to hate this video. Oh, sorry, I was misguided. It was three clubs. I said Essendon. No, you didn't. You said ah! Oh, no, try. <laughs> All right, so, what do you want, three? Who cares? <laughs> um, the last one is actually a hard one too. Tim Moore. And I'll pronounce it... Oh, sorry, I'll spell it for you. It's M-O-H-R. But that's Carlton. Did you say Carlton? Yes. Then you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's GWS and Hawthorne. Oh my goodness. So that was an absolute obliteration. So you've literally just showed up on your own channel just to school me and just be like, Drewsy knows nothing. Don't listen to him. This is why he only has 4,000 subs and I have... How many? 11? Uh, 12 and a half. 
Top and a half. Yeah. Just that much. I thought this was going to be more competitive. I'm sorry. I thought you were going to pluck a few real hard ones for me. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you enjoyed me destroying Drizzy in this obscure AFL player challenge. I didn't think it was going to be this one-sided, but I'll take the W. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit subscribe. Let us know in the comments as well your favorite obscure AFL player. Also, if you want me to do this video with someone a little more competent, comment Busher. <laughs> Also, while you're there, subscribe to my good friend Druzy. He, oh, thanks, mate. He needs it after this obliteration. <laughs> um, he makes good content. Uh, charity. Does a real good job. And uh, <laughs> you can find the link in the description just for, for more charity. Go on. I'm going back in my shell now. <laughs> thanks, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Is it safe? So, Jesse, um, how are your nuts feeling today? Medium rare. Perfect.